everyone and welcome to a look inside cast in chrome. Today we're going to focus on the 1940 Bantam, American Bantam convertible coupe. Um, this is going to be part of the exhibit cast in chrome which opens April 24th and it's part of the theme space oddity. So in this particular theme we're looking at the space race as well as just kind of accessory ornaments that were well odd. But today we're going to look at the 1940 Bantam designed by Alex Tremulis. That's known for his work in the 1940s concept car, the stainless steel Tucker. So Tremulis is an American-born designer, born in 1914 and died in 1991. And he does work um, predominantly for larger companies, Chrysler, Duesenberg, Cord, and he is very prominent in these areas of streamlined modern design. So at the time, the president of Bantam, Roy Evans, uh, um, approached Tremulous to design a car for him here, the, the Bantam built here in Butler, Pennsylvania, because he wanted a more modern design. Before the 1940s, the Bantam had been uh, more of a boxy, uh, coupe style car, he wanted much more glamorous. So he designs, he has tremulous design, the Hollywood and the Riviera. So here we have the 1940 convertible. It was donated in 1999 by G. Whitney Snyder. Uh, so it is part of this for collection. The thing about this car, the ornament here is in line with what becomes modern design. So at the, the turn of the 1930s, 1940s, the hood ornament design really transitions from uh, locomotives and steamships into space race rockets and jet planes, more aerodynamics. So Tremulous is really on the cusp of that design changeover. And we have, like I said, more of this aerodynamic, the way that air moves around vehicles, especially cars, as well as ballistics, the way that objects move through the air. So Tremulous designs this rocket style um, ornament with its sleek designs curved areas, but also, again, looking kind of a nod to the future of rockets in space. So this trend continues up through the 1950s with planes and trains kind of evolving into rockets and even UFOs. Tremulous is known for his UFO design that is an aftermarket accessory that can be found sought after by collectors um, as a very high value object. And it kind of gets to the end of that space race in the 1950s. The, the space um, rockets, large planes on cars really ends about the 1950s into the early 1960s when hood ornaments really go out of fashion and what we think of as the 1950s of fins and larger bodied cars really becomes more prominent. So this is really the end of the hood ornament era as we know it and Alex Tremulous really takes us from locomotives to outer space. So thank you for today's video. I'd like to thank the Richard King Mellon Foundation, the Pennsylvania Bureau of Tourism, and the Allegheny Regional Asset District for their continued support of our programming here at the Frick. And we'll see you on the next episode.